Hello, Maurits here. Um, I got a question about uh, an old exam question. So this is from uh, November 10, uh, paper 2, uh, time zone 0, and I think it's question 4. Okay, so the question is that they state that we have two vectors, uh, one of them being uh, 2 minus 3 is 6, the other one being uh, k minus 2 4, k should be larger than 0, and the angle between uh, E and W uh, is pi over 3 and the question is find the value of k so what I would do here is we'll start with writing by definition that uh, we'll use the product here since we know that the two vectors multiplied will be the length of the first one times the length of the second one times cos of the angle in between and since we know that the angle is pi over 3 and cos of pi over 3 is 1 half we can of course replace this by 1 half and then we simply take uh, everything and fill it in. So we have 2 minus 3 is 6 uh, times uh, k minus 2 4. Remember this is the dot product, the scalar product. Equals to the length of the first one, which is 2 square plus minus 3 square plus 6 square. Uh, times the length of the second one, which is k square uh, plus minus 2 square plus 4 square right, and then times the cos of the angle, which is 1 half. This we can expand 2 times k right, 2k plus minus 3 times minus 2, which is 6, plus 6 times 4, which is 24, equals to square root of. 4 plus 9 plus uh, that's 6, right? Times the square root of k square plus 4 plus uh, 16 times 1 half. Okay, now we simplify this again. This will give us 2k plus uh, 30, right? equals to 36, oh that is 49, square root of k square plus 20 times 1 half. I would multiply by 2 to get rid of this, it doesn't really matter, but let's do that. So we get 4k plus 60 equals to square root of k square plus and of, I forgot that, square root of 49, of course, is a 7 there. Okay, so we have an equation that we need to solve. And this is a paper 2, so we have access to the calculator. Uh, we could, in principle, square both sides, and that will make this a quadratic expression too. And then we get a quadratic equation which we can solve. That is too much to do, and I forgot my calculator. Wait a sec. Okay, back again. This is unedited, so I won't do anything about this. There will be a pause, pause here. 
Um, we'll take the graph, the calculator, and go into uh, graph mode. Okay, so we are in graph mode. Uh, I want just just want to put the graph mode as standard there. Okay, so what we do uh, in our calculator now is uh, we enter these two equations. So say, and of course instead of k, we want we want to write x because it's the only thing that can work here. So four x plus sixty as the first equation, seven times square root of x square plus 20 for the second equation draw and we see basically nothing and the reason for that is of course the graph is somewhere completely else we can realize this from the 60 here so I got the window and I changed the scale in some way I have no clue what if I need to change this but we change this since we're 60 here I put say 100 try to draw I got something but we have a positive solution in that direction so I can take the wind again so exchange this change this to something say 20 we have try a bit and this one we need to extend it in that direction so 150 and we have a intersection over that in the corner right so G solve on this model depends on what you have, calculate you have and intersect that solution we find first, that is not what we're interested in since k should be larger than zero. Uh, and there we find the second one at 18.77. So rounded th three significant figures, that would be uh, that k equals to 18.8. .8. And then we have answered the question. Hope this helps a bit. As I said, if you get something like this, don't try to to, to expand this on, on a paper too. Uh, you have access to calculator, so don't do too much algebra. Uh, I mean, you could even have skipped to multiply the two up there, and then you just have seven over two, that would work fine. Uh, but that is how I would do it. And here, of course, using the GUC or something. And we're done. Thank you.